going to give you one minute. Okay. I'd like you to very simply name as many Marvel movies as you can. Oh boy, okay. Paul Rudd, how are you doing? I'm great. How are Fantastic. you? I'm actually not doing so hot. I've, no? uh, I've got a serious case of quantum mania. I don't know if you've uh, seen this been going around lately. <laughs> Look at you. I you uh, did it. I did it. I mean, you did it. I did it. And I tell you something, uh, it suits you because I don't know if you're if it's an acute case of quantum mania you're uh -huh. suffering from, but it's given you a nice glow. Mm -hmm. It seems as if it's put a little pep in your step. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, it affects people differently. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think it works with you. You don't need to be cured. You're, you're only getting better from that. Sometimes not a bad thing to catch. <laughs> Great way to catch it is to see this film in cinemas right now. Who are you looking at? Uh, one of my friends is over there. Oh. He's got quantum mania. Um, this film was great for me because it pairs arguably the two biggest cinematic uh, universes, Marvel and I Think You Should Leave. Stinky! What? How starstruck were you by Ruben the day you saw his beautiful by face? Way. First of all, no joke. Yeah. This is the best thing anyone has said to me <laughs> because as a Tim Robinson, I Think You Should Leave enthusiast, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. when Ruben showed up, I believe, the technical term would be, I lost my shit. <laughs> you flew off the handle like a steering wheel that wasn't properly attached. Yeah. That is a good idea. I was so stoked. Mm -hmm. Like, oh my God, it's the guy from I think we should leave. He was amazing. Yeah. He really is kind of, you know, I don't think it would surprise you say, oh yeah, no, I think I know what that guy's like. You'd be right. Yeah. It's not really a character as well as I can no, tell. No, 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 no. no, no. Uh -uh. Uh, actually, speaking of Ruben, he mistakes your character for Spider-Man in mm -hmm. this film. Yeah, they're yeah. both bugs. Right. Got me thinking, I don't think you've ever, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't think you and Tom Holland have ever actually had like an MCU scene together. You had a little fight in Civil War. <laughs> That's right, yeah. But the bug boys have never... Never really, you know, we've talked about it actually. You, you and Tom? Yeah. Really? Yeah. He's a great, I mean, he's a great guy. He's great. And yeah. Uh, yeah, early on, I think we were saying, gosh, I'd love to, I'd, we should, it would be fun to have some crossover. It makes sense. Yeah. Spiders, ants. Black and, Widow. Well, very dangerous. Well, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, yeah, well, I mean, spiders and ants, I think they're probably enemies perhaps in nature, but not all. Yeah, exactly. Been, and by the way, they've lived together in harmony for eons. And what was Tom like? Yeah, sounds like a great idea. That's exactly what yeah. you do. A great time. Yeah, I, did. I get mistaken. I'll yeah, just put yeah. my voice. Yeah. yeah. Um, I've got a little challenge for you. I just spoke to um, some of your co stars, okay. Evangeline and Catherine. I gave them this test. Uh -huh. They told me you'd be very good at this. Mm. Okay. I'm going to give you one minute. Okay. I'd like you to very simply name as many Marvel movies as you can. Oh boy, okay. I'm gonna try and tick them off. All right, so Iron Man 1, 2, 3. Mm -hmm. uh, Captain America, Captain uh, uh, America Winter Soldier, mm -hmm. Civil War, mm -hmm. um, Black Widow, Thor 1, 2, and 3. Can I just do that or yeah, I have to say yeah, Ragnarok? Yeah, Is that, okay. Um, there's Black Panther, uh, Wakanda Forever, the Guardians of the Galaxy 1, 2, and 3. Nice. There's, um, oh God, who am I? What, is it? what, what about me? Uh, Young British boy. Oh yeah, well, the Spider Man, of yeah, course. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, oh my God, Tom Holland. I get away. I'm so sorry. Please <laughs> forgive me. Uh, there's a three of those. Um, You're very close. All, all the Avengers movies, one, two, and three. Uh, yep. There's an Infinity War and Endgame, and then there's the... Um, I'm Benedict. That's a clue. Oh yeah, well of course Doctor Strange. There I mean, go. you got a couple of those. Uh, wow, boy, pressure is on. And then... Um, the you, Fablemans? The Fable... You've nailed it, yes. Yeah, the Fablemans. The, the scariest Marvel oh movie of all. Oh my gosh. There's Spider-Man, mm -hmm. Ant-Man, mm -hmm. Fableman. <laughs> one, two, and three. Fable man, a man who tells stories. Yeah, that's, yeah exactly. <laughs> that's how he gets yeah, it. Yeah, that's such a, like, here comes Fable man. Oh, God, get ready. It's gonna have a lesson. Oh, it's just endless with this one. Let's see what we can learn from this guy's story. <laughs> uh, Paul, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Have a lovely day.